So that was how new Black Stars coach Chris Hilton was given a rousing welcome at the Akwesidai Festival in Kumasi on Sunday. The Black Stars coach joined a delegation from the Ghana Football Association led by Vice President Mark Addo to attend the Akwesidai Festival in Kumasi on Sunday, March 19, 2023. The beautiful Akwesidai festival is celebrated by the Ashanti people and chiefs in the Ashanti region. The festival is celebrated on a Sunday once every six weeks. Sunday's Akwesidai festival was held at the Menshia Palace and the delegation from the GFE was warmly welcomed by the traditional authorities and other attendees. The presence of coach Chris Hutton, who is said to be unveiled as the new Blasters coach on Monday, added to the excitement surrounding his appointment as the new head coach of the Ghana national team. The new Blackstars head coach Chris Hutton and his assistant, George Boaton, were spotted basking in smiles as they enjoyed the celebrations and had a good time witnessing the beautiful culture and tradition on display. Let's watch the video of Chris Hutton when he attended the Akwesidai festival in Kumasi. <laughs> So that was how Black Stars head coach Chris Hutton and his assistant George Boaton attended the Akwesidai festival in Kumasi on their arrival on Sunday. Coach Chris Hutton is in Kumasi purposefully for his official unveiling as the new head coach of the Black Stars. The former Black Stars technical advisor has been given the national team job and replaces Coach Otuadu who was in charge of the team at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. The unveiling ceremony for Coach Chris Hutton is expected to be held at the SG Mall on Sunday, March 20 at exactly 10 a.m. At the unveiling ceremony, Coach Chris Hutton will have the chance to tell Ghanaians what to expect now that he is in charge of the national team. The Ghana Football Association is also expected to make known the contract details of Chris Hutton as he has been appointed, so we will get to know the duration of his contract, what he is expected to earn as salary as well as his target whether to qualify Ghana for the next AFCON or win the next AFCON with the Black Stars and all that. Well, information gathered indicates that Coach Chris Hutton has signed a three-year deal with the national team. The Ghana Football Association hope that the coaches participation in the festival will help to build a stronger connection with the team and the local community, inspiring fans to turn out in large numbers for the upcoming match against Angola in the AFCON qualifiers. The Black Stars have had a mixed record in recent years, but with Chris Hutton at the helm, there is renewed optimism about their chances. The coach brings a wealth of experience to the Black Stars, having previously managed a number of top-tier teams in England, including Norwich City, 
Brighton and Hove Albion and Nottingham Forest. As the team prepare for their match on Thursday, the GFE are working hard to get more support from football fans in Kumasi. And now before we go, the Barbara Sports Stadium is ready to host the Black Stars game against Angola on Thursday, March 2023. The video you see is the current state of the Barbara Sports Stadium. The Barbara Sports Stadium was recently closed to preserve the pitch for the Black Stars huge game against Angola and the good news is that it's back to its best state with the pitch looking very green and in a very good condition. The stadium will be open to the public on Wednesday, March 22, for both the Black Stars and the Angola team to have one day training session before their match on Thursday. This means the Black Stars will begin their training session in Accra before moving camp to Kumasi later in the week. The Black Stars will play Angola on Thursday and later travel to Luanda to face them in the return leg on Tuesday, March 27. So that is it for this episode of Sports Update Ghana. Thanks for watching. Please leave a comment in the comment section and don't forget to like, share and subscribe. See you in the next one.